I am a full-body cyborg, which means I've been dismantled and regenerated countless times. I have sensations of pain, have memories, and self-awareness, but these are merely signals. What does this mean? What is the nature of my existence? Perhaps I am no different than a flickering flame. But where am I destined to go? Emergency dispatch during my tune-up? Yes, go ahead. Seventeen minutes ago, the National Assembly Building received a bomb threat. The police pursued the perpetrator, but he evaded arrest and is now at large somewhere in the port. We've received an order to dispatch our unit. And where to clean up the mess the police left? What intel do you have? Just some personal details Togusa dug up. I'm transmitting it now. Okikatsu Oribe. 38 years old. Ex-military cyber warfare engineer with a history of terrorist activities. He was last heard from wreaking havoc on government and corporate websites from the remote mountains in the Republic of Cusa. <laughs> Sounds like his hacking skills are pretty good. Speaking of which, he hacked into the military's database seven minutes ago and walked out with this gem. An armored suit? Hmm. This must mean the bomb threat is just a diversion, and he's planning on launching a direct attack. The ambassador of Kuzin is in Japan meeting about war reparations, huh? He left the assembly building and is en route along the port highway, so it must be Oribe's target. He's continuing a war that has no end. We're almost there.
Please don't hurt him. You know, he's not wrong. Who are you? You see, all he wants is to end the war. No, the war is over. You're consumed by emotions, letting it imprison you. Wait, where are you going? trying to accomplish with your fully prosthetic body. Lori Bay, don't try to talk to me like you know me. Besides, I find your brand of terrorism crass and crude. It's not my style. One way or another, I'm going to end this war. I'm doing it for my wife. She's in a refugee camp. I saw her. The only thing the two of you will accomplish is prolonging the conflict and destruction. That's enough! You aren't protecting her. You're protecting a false memory that was overwritten by Firestarter.
The person you want to protect is gone. She is not here. Not in this world. Not in your past. Shut up! This isn't the reality I live in! The war is already over. You're wrong! Yuri. Truly loved a human! No use. I have your ghost, so you can't run. Regarding the suspect, Oribe, analysis has determined that he was indeed infected with a virus, one that caused the pitiful victim to seek hope in the past. Have you ever truly loved a human? What spawned that question? Even knowing it was a false memory created by Firestarter, he chose to run toward it. I just think if it were me, I... Whoa, whoa, hold on. You feeling okay? See, this is why you shouldn't take a mission right after a tuna. <laughs> You're right. I'm going to take a nice long nap. I am a full-body cyborg, which means I've been dismantled and regenerated countless times. I have sensations of pain, have memories, and self-awareness, but these are merely signals. What does this mean? What is the nature of my existence? The flickering flame that's inside of me can't help but keep searching for an answer. 